So this awesome bold look was inspired by the amazing graffiti art in my city. Without further ado, let's get started. I'm taking the color Savage from Urban Decay and I'm going to be putting that all over my lid. And if you guys didn't already know, I am using the Electric Palette from Urban Decay and I'm going to be taking the color Jilted and putting that in the inner corner and the outer corner on top of the pink that I had already laid down, trying to stay within the boundaries, trying to keep it nice and neat. Now I'm going to darken that up with the color Urban and doing the exact same thing, keeping the bright pink super bright towards the middle and darkening it up towards the edges. And what you see me doing here is reshaping what I have done. I kind of didn't like the shape that I gave it. I felt like it was a little too rainbow shape and I wanted it to be a little bit more cat eye. So I'm just shaping it up with some concealer and then we'll move on. Since this look was completely improvised and I just placed colors where I thought they would look nice, I initially got a combination of Freak and Thrash and put it on top of this pink, but I wanted something a little bit brighter and that just wasn't the color for me, so then after I applied those two colors, I went ahead and put Gonzo on top of what I had. Dusting out the fallout, oh yeah. And here all I'm doing is lining my eyes with the amazing NYC Black Liquid Liner. It's only like $2 and you can find it at Walmart or Target and it will save your life. With this look, I was initially just going to do a regular wing liner, but like I said, this video was really improvised. So I decided to bring the liner all the way up into my crease. Then I'm going to be taking a dark black eyeshadow and connecting it from the bottom to the top. Then re, I guess, brightening the middle part with the same pink color that I got. Then I'm going to be taking an Urban Decay lip liner and I'm going to be lining my eyes with that. I wanted to add a really unexpected bright pop of color on the bottom and I picked up this NYX pencil but I didn't like it for the under eye, it didn't come up at all. So then I just decided to use it for my lips and my lips were actually really dry. So I decided to prime them with this Too Faced Lip Primer which is amazing. It is mattifying so it is going to be a little bit more drying as well but it's going to make the color more bold. So while I let my lips set and dry, I'm going to be moving on to my eyes and just applying some mascara, prepping them for my falsies. Once my lips were dry, I went back with a lip pencil and tried filling them in. This was like not the best idea, but I really wanted that bright color and that's the only product that was giving me the effect that I wanted, but it completely dried out my lips and it was super gross and sticky, so I wouldn't recommend it for a long time, um, even though it was a little bit difficult to come off, which is pretty cool if you're wanting a long wear lipstick. I know Jeffree Star is coming out with a yellow lipstick, so I will definitely be purchasing that. And now I'm taking a NYX yellow eyeshadow and I'm just putting it on top of my lips to kind of fill in the cracks and spaces that the liner did not fill. 
So after your lips are all done, just pop in some falsies and your look is complete. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Make sure you like and subscribe to this video and stay tuned for more.